What's up everyone, welcome to the channel. Today we have 2022 Topps Heritage High Number. I actually got a case of this, so this is gonna be a six part video series where we're gonna rip two uh, boxes per video. Um, this was, I think like 500 something, 580 from uh, Dave and Adam's Card World. Decided to go for this uh, as I was considering getting a Bowman 2024 Jumbo, but that's like $500 and it's just a lot for one box. So I thought, you know what? I'm gonna go with my first case ever. So join me on my journey as we open up six of these and see how, or I mean 12 of these and see how we do. Got a pretty good deal. I think they actually still have it uh, as a deal on their site. So anyway, here we go. We're gonna start speed ripping now. Actually, uh, pause, I forgot we get a box topper. So resume speed ripping. And pause again. Here is our next box topper. We got Jim Bra Bra Brazil. I think that's uh, actually a significant one. We got, we got that little corner thing there. Um, I think that stamp, I don't know if that's like a rare thing, but uh, I'll have to check that out. Could be a rare hit. Um, but anyway, cool. We got some interesting marks there. Uh, so I'll put that off to the side. I'm not sure if that's a stand-worthy card or not, but uh, we will go ahead and continue with the speed rip. All right, speed rip complete. We have this glorious amount of packs here. And uh, we will go ahead and get right into it. Hope you've been enjoying the baseball season as much as I have. Got my uh, first week of fantasy is finally over. Uh, tied in my matchup. So first matchup or first fantasy season that it's been for a while for me. So um, I will go back through these and see if there's any short prints or image variations, whatever. I'm not too familiar with the product because uh, I was not collecting back in 2022, but have recently got into it. So that was another reason for me to feel like I wanted to rip uh, this product in particular. And yeah, I mean, just 2024 Bowman was, I think, 275 for one hobby box and uh, 500 for a jumbo, in which you get three autographs. I don't know. It just seems like a crazy amount to spend um, when most of it's paper, too. Uh, I mean, here I am ripping her uh, Heritage, but... But, yeah, I mean, you got proven rookies in here. You got Bobby Witt and... Uh, J Rod, you get an autograph. Probably, I'm, I'm hoping for three autographs, and then you get uh, one of these chromes. So there's, there's a nice one right there, Christian Pache. It's a number to six seventy three. So those cards look really cool. Uh, I guess we'll put them on the stand for now. We'll see if he gets moved off. And let's see. So we're looking for our J Rods. Bobby Witz, Spencer Torkelson, Spencer Strider, and among others in 2022. But yeah, I just, uh, I'd rather go through a case. I thought it'd be fun. Never had gotten one before, so. All right, let's see. Go relatively quick through these. Don't want the video to be too long. So none, no image variations or error logo. I think those are the three, or maybe there's more. All right, Jose Trevino, Edward Cabrera. There's one Yepes for the Cardinals. Okay, let's see. No image or anything. I think that's, it's like underneath the baseball there from what I've seen from others. I did watch uh, Striker <clears throat> open up a case of this and it was kind of a, can you make your money back kind of video. Taking, to, taking into account grading Bobby Witts and uh, J-Rod rookie cards. So that's an interesting series if you want to check that out. But that was part of the inspiration for me wanting to do this. Got 2024 Heritage coming out in a couple days. 
That set looks pretty cool. The design for, I think, 74. There's C.J. Abrams. There's a really nice one to get as well. Spencer Torkelson. And we'll check through, make sure we didn't miss any image variations. Doesn't look like it. Good old feeling of like old time wax packs. And there we go, our first J-Rod. Very nice, looks pretty good. Uh, let's see. Got Gosuke Katao. I've never seen that name before. <clears throat> Get this pack open. So anyway, thanks for joining me on this video. We appreciate a like on the chan on this video and a subscribe to the channel. There's a nice Spencer Strider right there. It's not image or anything, but it put him in the pile with J-Rod. But anyway, I'm going to continue to have more videos coming to you. Like I said, this is going to be a six video series, two boxes each. And the following ones will be more are quicker rips because I will have seen most of the product. <clears throat> So this design is okay. It's not particularly eye-catching, but it's fun rip. All right, let's see. Got H. A. Pollock, John Gray, looking very inquisitive. And there's Ryan Mountcastle, Matt Brash, rookie card. And that's halfway through the first box. On to the next deck. Haven't gotten our hit yet. Going to get one patch or auto per Matt Olson there. One uh, per box. Now you have those. Uh, oops, I didn't check some of those image ones before. There we go. They have the uh, real one autographs in here. And then the very rare coveted red ink auto. So they're usually numbered to like 73 or something. I'm not sure. Alexander Wells, looking very happy that he's in the major leagues. Not sure if he is anymore, but it's nice Cardinals there. Check these. Don't see any image variations. Okay, keep on going. <clears throat> so I'm not sure if you get, I think you get like one, maybe one of those chrome ones per box. I'm not sure about that. There's also some, there's MJ Melendez rookie card. That's a good one as well. I think there's uh, some black bordered ones that are pretty rare as well to get out of like 72 or something. Hope to get one of those. Josh Reddick. There's Seiya Suzuki rookie card. Very nice. Battery Mates. Ozzy Albies and Acuna. Braves looking really stacked. There's Shogo Akiyama. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, yeah, I'm not sure. This just looks like an insert. I am not sure of like the if there's like super short print inserts or anything like that. Probably not in this product. I think Heritage is known for that. Get a lot of base. No Bobby Witt Jr. yet. There's Juan Soto in the Padres. Uniform and nothing really there. Lots and lots of cardboard. Carlos Correa, it's Chris Bryant. You know, I saw something crazy that he was like getting death threats and just tons of criticism from Rockies fans because of his performance, um, which is pretty nuts. Stecken Rider. I thought it was Strider, but now it's Stecken Rider. <clears throat> but anyway, yeah, I think he has a, a kid now, and I don't know, life is just probably different for him. Not as focused on baseball. He had his time. I'm not saying he couldn't have a comeback, but the death threats is just nuts. All right, let's see. 
Got Peyton Henry. There's a Spencer Torkelson. I think he had 30 plus homers last season. And Giovanni Moran. So still no hit. This is uh, we've got five packs left in this first box. Kind of surprising that we haven't hit it yet. Hoping we hit an auto in our first box and not uh, a patch, but we'll see. There's Stephen Kwan, not a good rookie. Um, Nolan Ryan insert, no hitter, 1973. Oh, I didn't. I'm not checking the back again. I keep forgetting, but I'll go back through and check those. Let's see. Nope. So yeah, after you get a case of these for five hundred eighty dollars, uh, it comes out to, you know, forty seven dollars per box. Pretty good for a hobby box. Here's George Kirby and Bobby Witt Jr. Very cool. And Jake Myers. So got the J Rod and Bobby Witt. Uh, let's see, another torque. And there we go. Wow, look at that. Marcus Semyon, numbered to 19 or to 73. And that's what I was talking about. That's the rare red ink auto. <clears throat> Very cool. To hit that for sure. On card. Really nice looking auto. Sweet. Great hit there. And let's uh finish off the box. So we got two packs left in the first box. What a start. That's going to be my first uh, numbered red auto out of a Heritage product. Pretty cool. Cole Tucker, daydreaming. And we'll do a quick little check here. Nope. I did get a chance to see the Eclipse today. Pretty neat. I remember that seven years ago. It's hard to believe it's seven years ago. There's Elias Diaz. It looks like a short print, but it's not. A lot of these look like short prints. Miles Mikolas. Nice Cardinals PC hit there. Rylan Bannon. And that's going to do it for box number one. We've got uh, pretty much all the good rookies. A nice stack here. Torkelson, got two of those, got George Kirby, Bobby Witt, Spencer Strider, and J-Rod. And here we go, on to box two. Next stack of packs. I think we're making decent time. We'll try and hurry on a little bit. All right, so there's another Torkelson. And let's see, there we go. So yeah, we've got one auto already. I'm still thinking that we're going to get three out of the case. We'll see. It's got a Crawford rookie card. And there's Ronzi Contreras rookie. Nice to get a rookie. Very off-centered to 373. So that's pretty sharp looking card besides the off-centered. Just need to get a J-Rod. Bobby Witt Jr. of that. Okay, so starting to see some of the same collation there. <clears throat> All right, so we got Gonsolin, and there's a rookie performers, uh, Bobby Witt Jr. rookie insert. Very nice. And we're going to keep going. Max Scherzer on the back. It's a nice Seiya Suzuki rookie. I've seen, I feel like I've seen this pack already. Javier Baez. I'm just, I'm not going to check every single card right now. Uh, if I had the uh, image variations or not, I I, maybe I'll do that at the end. I'll just kind of speed through that and that'll be the end of the video. Isaac Paredes. So no rookies there. So I'll kind of make a pack or a stack there for me to go through. Kind of went through some of those already. This pack feels a little thicker. Probably going to be a mem hit. Nope, just thicker. Insert. 
All right, so that's going to be Rod Carew. And nothing much else going on in that pack. So yeah, I have to check that uh, Jim Brazil, Brazil card. The 50th anniversary stamp is on there. Chris Sale. Clayton Kershaw. I don't think I've seen that one yet. Or maybe I have. I don't know. All right. Making our way through. Got Bryce Elder. Rookie card. Lucius Fox. Lucius just makes me think of... Uh, uh, the Dark Knight. Wasn't that Morgan Freeman's character's name, Lucius? Where he refuses to be a part of his spying program. Alright, let's see. Jack Swinski, rookie. Solaire. Castillo. Royce Lewis. There's a good one. Jack Lopez. I think Royce Lewis is probably underrated going into 2024. See what kind of season he has. Hunter Green, rookie card. It's a decent one there. And Connor Pilkington. All right. Jose Trevino. These cards get stuck together sometimes. Rene Pinto. Some of these names I have not heard of. <clears throat> All right. Cabrera. Seen him. Nick Gordon. Ethan Roberts. This card feels like thinner for some reason. Joe Adele. And no more rookies there. All right, halfway through second box. On to the next half. Cooper Hummel. Bryson Stott. It's a decent one there as well. And getting stuck again. Stephen Kwan. It's a nice show, hey? I don't know why I'm doing that. It's not shiny. It's just a normal cardboard card. Okay. George Springer, Matt Chapman. Let's see. Nothing really going on here in the last, or in the second box. I think we've got that Ronzi. So it's looking like that. I, I guess I, I thought I mixed up the packs, so maybe I didn't mix them up too well. There's Trevor's story. And there's our hit. It's going to be a game-used Starling Marte. So, not the greatest hit, but that's all right. Got a bat piece, at least. I like getting the bat pieces over the jersey swatches. Put that over here. And we will keep on moving on. Kevin Smith for the A's. Those A's. There's a nice O'Neill Cruz. Looking pretty good. Oh, there's Bobby Wood Jr. There's our second one of him. O'Neill Cruz is looking like a monster in spring training. Let's see if he has a pretty good, big comeback here. And let's see, Richie Palacios was on the Cardinals and got traded, so I think to the Rays. I'm not sure. All right, Trevor Larnack. There's Nick Lodolo, Jeremy Pena. I have an autograph of Jeremy Pena, number to five. So hoping he turns it around. There's Alec Thomas, rookie card. <clears throat> and just about six packs remaining here. <coughs> Excuse me. Still getting over a 
Cold. And there's CJ Abrams. And there's another J Rod. Very nice. Looking good. And 1973 All Star Game highlights. Hank Aaron. Always cool to get a Hank Aaron card. Let's see. Nothing else really going there. I think that's our second J Rod so far. Get a J Rod per box. Be okay with that. Zach Short. Uh, let's see. And nothing else really there. A few packs left. All right, Kyle Freeland. Oh, looks like we're going to have a black card coming up. Black border. So there's Spencer Strider, rookie. And that's going to be Ethan Roberts, rookie card. So I don't. these aren't numbered, but they're very rare, I believe. So pretty cool. I don't really know Ethan Roberts, but I'm glad to get one of those black bordered hits. It's a pitcher. And there we go. I think I might have just dinged the corner. All right, Corey Seager, Jorge Lopez. I think they have Chrome versions of those too, if I'm not mistaken. Jacob Robson. Here's the Elite Company, no longer. Poor Trout's just there by his own by himself. Trying to get those rookies in order. Logan O'Hop. Zach Neto. Let's see. Probably going to be it for this box. Don't imagine there would be much more in the box when they already gave me a black bordered card and a chrome. And the hits. So let's see what our last pack is going to be. There we go. Liam Hendricks, Scott Matt Olson, Kevin Kiermeyer. And that's going to be it. So I'm going to go ahead and just look through these and make sure I didn't miss any uh, image variation, logo error, whatever. So here's some uh, speed searching.
<clears throat> All right, so I don't didn't see any image variations or uh, name or error. I thought maybe this was something because it has the Oppenheimer name there, and then Pacheco. I don't know what that Pacheco, Pacheco. Anyway, uh, so I don't think those are variations because I saw another one just like that. But I think there's like stuff like. Uh, this position or logo will be different too. So I'll have to do a little more research on that, but uh, here's the results of our first two boxes. So we got this uh, Black Border rookie card, Ethan Roberts, got the game used, Darlene Marte, uh, nice rookie, Ronzi Contreras on the Chrome, number 373. The probably hit of the rip, for sure, not probably, is Marcus Semyon, number two, 19 of 73 with the red ink and then we got this one too i have to check that 50th anniversary stamp not sure if that's uh like a super rare card or not but uh yeah whatever it is what it is christian pache so thanks for watching we'll have the uh next video coming soon next two boxes um two out of six coming soon thanks for joining see you later